welcome back to my channel guys and i'm going to get straight into the video so guys dr love came out and addressed miss kitty he said that he is not a fan of miss kitty and he named out some things that miss kitty do that is not right and he make it very clear that he was not disrespecting her or nothing he is just talking what he sees now guys he said that miss kitty always come out and disrespect man and class up man and basically he is saying the reason why miss kitty is single is because of the way she is dr love say that miss kitty is very brawling and things like that now guys i do get where dr love is coming from it is clear that he don't like how miss kitty always come out and bring down man because she have her education and money guys to be honest a lot of women out there is like that and i don't know if miss kitty is one of those women but while watching dr love live I heard he play something of Miss Kitty talking so I don't know what to say guys anyways but as I said a lot of women out there is like that because they have their money they walk over people and think that they are better than the world and that is not right and as what Dr. Love said on the live most women out there that don't have much don't do things like that and again guys that is also true because when I check it out guys most women out there who don't have much and humble always married and man always want to be with them so guys it is good to be independent and look real good as a woman you know but that alone cannot cut it and that alone cannot keep a man you have to know how to treat a real man and things like that anyways guys let me move on so i was watching auntie d live yesterday and she was upset because a man donated 60 dollars to natalie and told her to squeeze auntie d 50 hundred dollars now guys we all know how auntie d is she don't play when it comes on to money and her name and i don't wrong her at all she was telling her team to be careful and anything people bless them with they must come to her and let her put it out in the camera because it's not everyone they can trust and guys i get where she was coming from she is saying a lot of people don't like her and they would try to set her up and that is so true guys but you know guys i don't understand some people i saw some people commented on the live saying that auntie d should bring that on live and she is blowing up the situation way too far and things like that like come on let auntie d do what she is doing because she is doing it for a reason and that is how she is she is very transparent and everything she put on the camera for her evidence and as i said i don't wrong her at all because a lot of these people trying for years to bring her down so anything is possible so she must have her evidence let me move on also guys erica really coming out strong for auntie d and i love that i watch another live that she did on her facebook page and she said that on mondays and thursdays she is going to come out and talk about all the good things that auntie d has done for people in jamaica guys erica said it's because of auntie d a lot of people start doing charity in phone now and we all know that that is true but guys as well what i said i love what erica is doing she is coming out and highlighting every good things that auntie d did and i think the time these people take to team up and tell lies to bring down this lady they need to highlight the good in her even let me said it on auntie d live friday let me said that people need to appreciate auntie d and give her her props guys you know what is the sad part about all of this the peoples that come out on social media trying to bring down auntie d don't even do one of the things she do for people in jamaica when i check it out guys they are so mean to people even their own family and friends and they don't have a good heart but guys yet still they they are trying to fight down a woman that have a good heart and is doing good for people but as what auntie d always say dmg to the flipping world and oh god bless no man curse so as always auntie d big up your nice clean self 
also guys i watch a live that erica did so she came out and speaks out after receiving lost wood papers from mr ansom so guys it is clear that mr ansom is taking things serious and he is not playing so he's taking erica to the courthouse but guys erica said that he cannot sue her because he have no proof to use against her and she also said that if anyone who's supposed to get sued is Mr. Ansom because he worked her for an entire day without pay and things like that. Now guys, this goes to show is not everybody you can mess around with on social media. Some people don't play when it comes on to their name and they're taking it to the court. So I hope people open up their eyes and know what they're doing and putting themselves in when they come out and talk up things about people on social media. And I hope they have their money ready as well. And even Anthony say it, she's going to take things serious and take things to a next level. She say that she have her people working and they are ready and they save videos and everything like that. So I hope the peoples that come out and try to tell lies on Anthony's name have their money ready for what's coming for them. But anyways guys, that's it for this one. I'm just going to keep it short as always. So thanks for watching and thanks for the support. I really do appreciate you guys a lot and remember guys to leave a like on the video and leave a comment on the video as well if you have anything to say about this one. Be sure to subscribe to my channel from now and turn on the post notification bell so you don't miss out on my next video. And as always, big up on a nice clean self my subscribers and viewers.